you can discern the signs of the times. Luke 21, verses 29 to 31. Then he, Jesus, spoke to them a parable. Look at the fig tree and all the trees. When they are already budding, you see and know for yourselves that summer is now near. So you also, when you believers see these things happening, know that the kingdom of God, the being caught up together, is near. What are these things? Matthew 24, verses 6 and 7, Mark 13, 7 and 8, and Luke 21, 10 and 11. Jesus answered and said to them, Believers, 1. You believers will hear of wars and rumors, threats of wars. See that you are not troubled. 2. For nation will rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. 3. And there will be great earthquakes in various places, i.e. around the world, and famines, hunger, catastrophes, etc., and pestilence, epidemic disease, and there will be fearful sights and great signs from heaven. A precursor to the being caught up together, the Ezekiel 38-39 war. This war may or may not take place before the being caught up together, aka the raptura or the rapture, but the nations mentioned coming together is definitely a precursor to the being caught up together. The five nations mentioned in Ezekiel 38-39 that conspired to attack Israel are Iran, Russia, Turkey, Libya, and Sudan. No one knows when. Mark 13, verse 32. And Jesus, answering them, believers, began to say, But of that day and hour, of the being caught up together, no one knows, not even the angels in heaven, God Almighty's holy angels, nor the Son, Jesus Christ, but only the Father, God Almighty. Fellow believers, Jesus Christ command to us, watch. Luke 12, verses 35, 37a, and 40. Then he, Jesus, said to his disciples, believers, let your waist be girded and your lamps burning. Blessed are those servants, believers, whom the Master, Jesus Christ, when he comes at the being caught up together, will find watching. And if he, Jesus, should come at the being caught up together in the second watch or in the third watch and find them, believers, so blessed are those servants, believers. Therefore, you believers also, be ready, spiritually alert, for the Son of Man, Jesus Christ, is coming at the being caught up together at an hour you believers do not expect. Matthew 24, verses 42 and 44. Jesus answered and said to them, Believers, watch therefore, for you believers do not know what hour your Lord Jesus Christ is coming at the being caught up together. Therefore you believers also be ready, spiritually alert, for the Son of Man, Jesus Christ, is coming at the being caught up together at an hour you believers do not expect. Mark 13, verses 35 and 36. And Jesus, answering them, believers, began to say, Watch therefore, for you believers do not know when the Master of the house, Jesus Christ, is coming at the being caught up together, in the evening, at midnight, at the crowing of the rooster, or in the morning, lest, coming suddenly, at the being caught up together, he, Jesus, find you believers sleeping, not spiritually alert. And what I, Jesus, say to you believers, I say to all fellow believers, watch. Luke 21, verses 34 to 36. Then he, Jesus, spoke to them believers, But take heed to yourselves, lest your hearts be weighed down with carousing drunkenness and cares of this life in the natural body. In that day, the being caught up together, come on you, fellow believers, unexpectedly. For it, the being caught up together, will come as a snare, a trap, on all those false teachers, false believers, and unbelievers who dwell on the face of the whole earth, Satan's world. Watch therefore and pray always that you believers may be counted worthy as children of God Almighty to escape through the being caught up together all these things, the seven-year tribulation that will come to pass and to stand in heaven before the Son of Man, Jesus Christ. The Holy Spirit and believers must go. Second Thessalonians 2 verses 6 and 7 And now you believers know what is restraining, the restrainer, the Holy Spirit, that he, the Antichrist, may be revealed in his own time, 
absent the presence of the Holy Spirit. For the mystery of lawlessness is already at work through Satan. Only he, the Holy Spirit, who now restrains, will do so until he, the Holy Spirit, which abides within all believers, is taken at the being caught up together out of the way, i.e. out of Satan's way. Hey, where did they go? Luke 17, verses 34 to 36. Then he, Jesus, said to the disciples, believers, I tell you, in that night there will be two men in one bed. The one, believers, will be taken, and the other, false teachers, false believers, and unbelievers, will be left. Two women will be grinding together. The one, believers, will be taken, and the other, false teachers, false believers, and unbelievers, left. Two men will be in the field. The one, believers, will be taken, and the other, false teachers, false believers, and unbelievers, left. Finally, how would they go? The being caught up together, a.k.a. the raptura or the rapture. 1 Thessalonians 4, verses 16 and 17. For the Lord Jesus Christ himself will descend from heaven, one with a shout, two with the voice of an archangel, God Almighty's holy angel, three with the trumpet of God, God Almighty, four, and the dead in Christ, pre-tribulation dead believers, will rise in their spiritual bodies first, five, then we, pre-tribulation living believers, who are alive and remain, shall be instantaneously supernaturally changed into our spiritual bodies. 6. And caught up together with them, pre-tribulation dead believers, in the clouds. 7. To meet the Lord Jesus Christ in the air. 8. And thus we, pre-tribulation dead believers and pre-tribulation living believers, shall always be with the Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ says to you, believers, and to all fellow believers, watch. Amen.